All right, now this is an important aspect I am going to share with you guys and this is about the battery test results of this all new One UI 3.0 beta running on Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. I am sure you would be curious to know the results. Before I share it, let me request you guys to hit that subscribe button to support the channel and leave a like for the video as well. You can also share your phone's battery test results if you are on One UI 3.0 beta so that the other viewers on the community can get benefited. Now, without wasting any more time, let's get started. I usually share real life battery test results instead of manual simulation and I have tested this on both high performance mode and power saving mode. If you have seen one of my previous videos which was regarding the changes on device care section, there are no multiple power modes on One UI 3.0 like it was in One UI 2.5. We just have one toggle to enable power saving mode. So I have tested it on both these scenarios. Now in the non power saving mode or I would say high performance mode, the display was at 120Hz refresh rate, auto brightness was turned on, dark mode was on, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth was on, location services was also on. Unused applications were put to sleep. With these settings I unplugged the phone at 9.30 in the morning with full charge and it lasted till 9.30 pm in the night with about 10% juice still left. And I got a screen on time of 5 hours 45 minutes. The usage patterns were pretty normal. I've used YouTube for about 1 hour 45 minutes, WhatsApp for about half an hour, calling about uh, 45 minutes to 1 hour, camera was used for about 10 minutes and then browsing and few other applications for few minutes. And the gaming was just for about 10 minutes. I did not play a graphic intensive game. I just played a basic game for about 10 minutes. All right, now the rest of the 10% would have extended the screen on time to maybe approximately six hours, 10 minutes, which is pretty decent, I would say. This is similar to the results I got on One UI 2.5 as well. So I did not notice any battery drain issues or heating issues in this beta version. Now coming to the second scenario, here I turned on the power saving mode, obviously in this mode the adaptive refresh rate was turned off and it was set to 60Hz fixed. But I tested this at WQHD instead of Full HD. The rest of the settings remained the same, so with this setting the results did not vary too much. Like in the previous test I got it fully charged at about 9.30 in the morning and at around 9.30 pm I was left with 10% battery with a screen on time of 6 hours 24 minutes which is about 40 minutes of incremental screen on time. I would say it's not bad. Again the additional 10% extended it close to 6 hours 51 minutes but my expectation was at least 7.5 hours on power saving mode at 60 hertz. Just to note, I had the same usage pattern like the previous scenario. I'm pretty sure with full HD on power saving mode is going to offer at least about seven and a half hours of screen on time, which is pretty decent if you're okay to stick with 60 Hertz display. So let's conclude this. The battery life on One UI 3.0 is as good as it was on One UI 2.5. So there is not much of a difference here. As of now, there is no issues on the beta version with respect to the battery life and even the overall experience has been pretty smooth. I did not come across any major issues on this upgrade. You guys let me know your experience if your phone is running on this beta version. Do support the channel by subscribing and smashing the like button. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.